Hey everyone, so this is the first video in a new like video series that we're gonna do um, where we go around and just try small bites around the various Disney parks and resorts. Um, so this is gonna be a much shorter vlog, but today we are here in Magic Kingdom at Liberty Square and I'm gonna check out something I have that has been on my list for a long time. We are at the Columbia Harbor House. I am gonna try the lobster roll. I'm very excited for this because I've heard nothing but great reviews, so I'm very eager to get inside and see what we got. All right, and here we is. I did a mobile order and it is opening time right now, so I did not have any weight at all, but it is served with french fries. I do want to point that out, but here is the lobster roll. I will say it's a good size. It looks like it's a good portion. Um, I'm only a little concerned though because there seems to be a lot of uh, butter. Butter? Is that what it butter? is? It looks like okay. it. It looks like it's clarified butter, but we'll see. Either that or it's excess liquid. So yeah, that's we'll what I was worried about. I was like, looks like there's a lot of liquid on top, <laughs> but we'll see. The fries are really good. Perfect fries. Is it atypical Disney fries or is it unique? No, I think it's typical. Okay. But they're really, really good. They're they're hot. They're nice and salted. Seasoned really well. Good French fries. Okay. okay but here is what we're here for. Alright, you're start. gonna go straight up. Nice into it. Yeah. We'll see what he thinks. Well, starting off with the french fries, they're good. Yeah. They need a little bit of salt, but they're good. The lettuce is a bit much. Right. Tuck that in there. Under season, like Mike said, the bun could be toasted more. I think there's a lot of things that could be done better, but for okay. a theme park thing, if you just want something quick to eat, this is this will do it for you. Right. With some criticisms, of course. <laughs> yeah. So there you go. Agree. And I definitely think this is nice because sometimes you can get a little burnt out on burgers and hot dogs in a theme park. Um, corn dogs. So this is definitely something different and I'm actually I'm really really glad I tried it out because I would have to say I would come back for this. You would? If, okay. if I was in the mood for a lobster roll, yeah. I would come here for sure. Right. Is it good? You like it? Yeah. Yeah? What's it taste like? I don't know what it tastes like. <laughs> it's lobster roll. Lobster we have these roll. at home. You want to take another bite? And try it again? Yes. Okay. It's a little messy. Now for me, for $16.99, I would expect it to be a perfect lobster roll, and I have to admit, this one's not perfect for me. They are very right in the description that it does just have a touch of mayonnaise and no other seasoning, so I almost want to go put some salt on this and pepper just to kind of spice it up a bit. Um, so just one word of caution when you look at that. $16.95, not the perfect lobster roll. All right, so that's going to do it for us today here at the Columbia Harbor House. Again, just as a reminder, this is in Liberty Square. It's right next to Haunted Mansion in Magic Kingdom in Disney World. I actually really like this place. I would definitely recommend it, especially if you're a little burned out from burgers and hot dogs. I would definitely check this place out. Well, we hope you liked our very first video in this new series where we're just going to do some small bites around the parks and the resorts. If you did, give us a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. And from our Magic family to yours, enjoy. Enjoy.